Former President Donald Trump has hinted that he could deport Prince Harry if he is re-elected, warning the Duke of Sussex that he will not protect him like Joe Biden. The former president spoke exclusively to the Daily Express U.S. at the CPAC conference in Washington, D.C., moments before appearing before a packed audience of conservatives who had waited hours for him. His comments came 24 hours after Prince Harry had appeared in court over whether he had lied on his immigration papers to the U.S. about his drug use, which he confessed to in his book Spare. The legal challenge has been pursued by the Heritage Foundation against Biden's Department of Homeland Security. They claim that, under U.S. immigration law, evidence of past drug use can be used as grounds to reject a visa application. Trump said he was furious at the Joe Biden administration for protecting Harry by keeping his immigration application confidential. He told Daily Express US, I wouldn't protect him. He betrayed the Queen. That's unforgivable. He would be on his own if it was down to me. Trump also believes the royal family had been too gracious to Harry after what he has done. It comes after Harry told ABC's Good Morning America that he had also considered applying to become a U.S. citizen. During the same interview, the Duke revealed he jumped on a plane as soon as possible to see King Charles after his father was diagnosed with cancer. Talking about his trip while in Canada to promote the Invictus Games, Harry said, I love my family. The fact that I was able to get on a plane and go to see him, and spend any time with him, I'm grateful for that, he said. Using the example of those taking part in the Invictus Games, he suggested such pressures could help to bring families together. Throughout all these families, I see it on a day-to-day -day basis, the strength of the family unit coming together, he said. Any illness, any sickness, brings families together, he said.